Hi, Hiram here. I'm going to do another test, boil test, on this NJ Chris's side burner alcohol stove. Yesterday I did, let me light this and get this going. Yesterday I did a test using my Boy Scout pot, which is kind of narrow for this big of a stove. So today I'm going to use this 16, hopefully you can see here, yeah, 16 centimeter Imusa pot. So the difference between the pots is the Boy Scout pot is about 5.136 inches. The Imusa pot is about six and a quarter inches. That'll leave about a half inch on each side all the way around for more uh, flames to hit the pot. So I got my water here at 59 degrees, the same as yesterday. That's why I'm trying to rush it here. Put that on the stove, start the timer. Okay, I don't know if you can, yeah, I think you can see on this, the flames look like they're hitting more of the pot, not just going right out over the edges. So, let's let this go and see how long it gets this to a boil. It's one fluid ounce, 30 milliliters of methanol. Room temperature is 70 degrees, humidity 54. It's raining and cloudy out. So, let's see how long this takes to get to a boil. Here we are at the two minute mark. The temperature is up to 110, 111 and climbing. I think that's a little lower than what it was on the last test. But I think you can see the flames have settled down and they're going across more of the pot. So let's see how long it does take this to get to a boil. There we have 210 to 11. To 12 at 7 minutes 10 seconds. 7 minutes 10 seconds. Okay, just goes to show you that you never can tell what's going to happen. Now, this took a little bit longer than yesterday. Using the Boy Scout pot with NJ Chris's stove took 6 minutes and 57 seconds to get to boiling from uh, 59 degrees. Today I started at 59 degrees with this larger pot and it took 7 minutes and 10 seconds so that's about like 13 seconds more. The whole thing is though the one, the first one was with the Boy Scout pot and now this is with an Imusa pot probably an entirely different metal so even a little thing like that can change the times. Probably what I should do is I got two, <clears throat> excuse me, I got two titanium pots, one larger than the other, but both of them made out of titanium. So maybe a test like this should be done with that. Uh, <laughs> like I always say though, I don't want to bore everybody to death by watching multiple tests on this. I know some people like watching me boil water, but uh, so it's up to you. If you want me to try to do the test again using titanium pots, I will, but this just shows you what happens with this. And again, this isn't a problem with uh, NJ Chris's stove. It's a larger version of a, excuse me, I got something in my throat, a larger version of a side, side burner stove. So it's made for bigger pots. Hmm, just trying to think here. Okay, so I thank NJ Chris again for the burner, the stove. I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions, and as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now.